Round one of this fixture gave us an all-time classic at the Chinnaswamy where 212 was chased down off an eventful last ball. What can we expect as Lucknow now host Bangalore? Uh, Tom Moody here to help set that up. Uh, has to be a very different approach, you'd imagine, given the kind of surfaces we've seen in Lucknow so far. Well, that's, that's the intriguing thing. We've got two different soils there from all accounts and they play, you know, remarkably differently. Uh, so, you know, the home side have, uh, I suppose, the advantage if they have the influence on what surface they'd like to play on against RCB. The other thing for RCB is they haven't uh, played at this venue and there's a few players that haven't played at this venue. So everything's going to be very new for them and this is the beginning of their road trip, so to speak. Yeah, it's a long month on the road. It's only the last game of the league stage when they'll see Chinnaswamy again. Yep. And it begins with what, you'd, what you could argue is perhaps the trickiest test given the way they line up. So how do, this, how do you see RCB as a batting unit approach this surface, especially if they get that other one? Well, it, well, that's going to be the interesting thing. I think they prefer the better batting surface, given that their lineup with uh, with Coley, with Faf, and Maxwell, and and the, the, so much reliance on on them firing, or at least two of the three firing, and others making contributions. Uh, if they get stuck on that slower wicket, where Abishnoi, for instance, will have his way. Um, it may well be a completely different uh, challenge for them where they, in, instead of being a high percentage boundary game, which is what they're used to playing at Chinnaswamy, they're going to have to uh, play a completely different brand of cricket. You mentioned Ravi Bishnoi and it was such an interesting uh, duel in, in that game at Chinnaswamy because his first three overs, he'd done a great job given just mm. 19 runs uh, in a very high scoring game. But then in the last one, Faf Duplessis got into him to place he comes in with strong numbers on the whole against Bishnoi. So RCB's top three in particular against Bishnoi, how do, how do you expect to see that play out? Well, again, I think it depends on the surface, but uh, uh, Bishnoi, I, I would uh, continue to back. Uh, as you quite rightly said, his first three overs, he controlled things and uh, bowled very, very well. Like any bowler, whether you're a spinner or not, there's going to be a time where there's an over that's collected particularly if you've got a batsman like a Faf Duplessis established at the crease, they're going to you know, um, have their way at some point. Um, but I think this, this contest, it, it's all going to revolve more around uh, what the conditions present and, um, and then what, you know, what team has the ability, one, to adapt. They're playing 11 with their substitute the best. Who's got the more flexibility to be able to do that? And secondly... Once the game's up and running, you know, what team's got the ability to, to adapt to that surface and make sure that they get um, uh, competitive if it is that type of scrappy game. To that point, uh, we've seen Lucknow use Amit Mishra as an impact sub, but they've used him sparingly. There have been yeah. some spells of one or two overs. Is this the ideal game for him to get a full go of four overs if things go on expected lines? Yeah, if it's going to be a slow turner, I'd imagine he, he will have very much a say because we, we talk about the big three and their batting order, they're all right-handers. So you'd welcome a leg spinner or another leg spinner. And he's very different to Bishnoi, you know. He's, uh, Bishnoi is more, you know, comes in, he's more like a Rashid Khan style of lead, lead, leg spinner that really relies more on that wrong and against the one that turns away from the right-hander, where Mishra is more your traditional leg spinner, you know, uh, out of the back of the hand, you know, side spin, getting the ball to turn away. So I'd imagine if we are getting that surface, Mishra will play an important role. Who are you fancying for this one? Uh, I think uh, Super Giants for this one. Win for Super Giants. We'll put them on 12 points. If RCB are to win, both teams will be locked on 10 points after nine games each. Yeah.